brief reflection on hope. A mullah story. The mullah is traveling on train and he sees the ticket conductor coming and he begins, to, he begins to look for his ticket in other people's pockets, into their suitcases. And they say, what are you doing there? So irritated these other passengers. Why don't you look for the ticket in your own pocket, your own suitcase? Mullah says, I could do that. But if I don't find it there, I shall lose all hope. This story has many levels of meaning. One is all of us humans, we desperately, we need hope. How do we cultivate hope? One is uh, the tradition say, can you build and grow faith? Uh, that wonderful poet Tagore says, faith is the bird that sings in the dark knowing that dawn is coming. The Quran says again and again, uh, do practices where you become conscious of the all-compassionate God. And if you are conscious of this higher intelligence, bring that into the center of your life. The Quran says, in times of affliction, spirit will provide ways of emergence in ways you cannot even imagine. Rumi says, yes, in times of affliction, a stretcher will come from grace. So building up faith. The second way to cultivate hope is, even in times of our despair, can we continue to do good deeds? No matter how small they are, just a smile, an act of service, because that creates a vibration which lifts us out of our gloom and despair and opens doors. A third one is, can I build community, authentic community? People I love, I trust, and who loves the truth because particularly in times of difficulties and despair, these wonderful members of our authentic community are able to give us advice, consolation, nurturance, that really gives us hope. Another wonderful verse by Rumi, uh, he says, Oh dear heart, never lose hope. Even if the whole world turns against you, keep your eyes on the friend. And one last verse from the Quran uh, that says that, you know, the earth was parched. There was no hope. But then the waters of mercy came down and the earth became clothed in, dream, in green. There is always hope.